actually, I see myself sitting on the computer making robots. I see myself as a lot better than when I came because like, I know how to like animate the, thing, the models already. Even though it was hard, it was really, really fun. It was the fun part because uh, my mind was challenged and I guess it is the same for everyone else. This summer, we opened a 3D character design workshop. Uh, this is specifically for uh, grade school and high school students because we wanted to start these children early, you know, ignite their passions, so that they can decide for themselves if they have the uh, inclination and, of course, the talent and the skills in order to take it a step further because we start them on basic training. Siyempre, summer, gusto ko may ginagawa sila na gusto rin nilang gawin. Basically, he just does drawings. I mean, nagsiscribo sa school, ganun lang naman siya, drawing, drawing. Nagigising talaga siya ng maaga para pag, pagpunta dito sa class niya eh. Exciting talaga sa kanya yung experience. Lance was very happy to, to be able to create his own characters. She really had fun learning about the things she learned sa workshop. Mahilig talaga siya. Ever since ano, uh, grade 4 pa lang siya, nag-ano na siya eh, nag-flash animation na siya. I think dito may enhance yung ano niya, yung creativity niya. Tsaka this is one of the best schools. The vision of CAIT is actually to uh, inspire the passion among these kids so that uh, they can decide if this is a career that they'd like to get into. Uh, so part of the program actually includes a tour of Anino Games and for their works to be showcased off uh, among the Anino Games art director and in order to help the kids. Anino Games is the longest running video game company in the Philippines. Uh, the vision of Anino Games is to bring together the creative talent uh, in the Philippines. Diba? bring together the creative talent so that we can create products that we can showcase around the world. And the vision of CIIT is very much, much aligned. Uh, CIIT brings together, uh, brews this talent, uh, especially with, uh, with the youngsters. Well, the workshop was fun, but it was really difficult. But, you know, you, you get to feel the sense of accomplishment afterwards because it's hard. <laughs> and when you make things, you, feel, you, you start to feel like, whoa, this is hard, but I can do this. I feel proud. It's a new achievement and it's something new for me. I've learned a lot of things in this workshop. It was fun. I wanted to expand my, um, I wanted to expand my knowledge because at first, uh, mostly 2D lang ginagawa ko. And then I just I want to I want to do 3D because I really want to uh, design game characters. I can I can create game characters now. Kahit sobrang basic lang. I I know the basics of 3D modeling. If I continue that, maybe I can get into um, my my dad's friend's company. I would I I would usually just stick with 2D and stuff because I can't animate 3D. Well now I can, so that's cool. The workshop was fun for me because um, it was really cool creating characters and knowing that making 3D animations weren't that complicated after all. This is something that they, they can also pursue as a career, not just as a hobby. Uh, this is a career that's also very much in demand uh, 
with the revolution, the internet revolution that we have because a lot of companies right now really need the creative talents and that's something that uh, kids, that's something that Filipinos are very good at.